fucking hell. Blue lights don't give way to the right. Right, the back way to Hillbury when the roads are closed. Now that is Onken Shoprite, pretty big place to find. And uh, I'd really love to go left here and miss out the traffic lights, but for the good of the people, I will go down to the junction and show you where it goes. We're sitting here may as well tell you if I go down here and turn right I've come to a roundabout one of them leads down to Summer Hill and the promenade Douglas main promenade if I went straight across it it would take me to governor's roundabout just down and right just on the other sort of side of those trees is the petrol station in Onken so that's a marker coming from that way sort of further in Douglas and we're gonna be going left here Take a gear. Right. So this is the main traffic lights in Onken and we are headed north. We've got a library. And we're going to be following this Cleo. So we've got church on the right, zebra crossing, that's going to be the easiest one. And we're turning off the main road, there's only one way. Twenty zone. And that's Onken Primary School. There is two schools in Onken, Ashley Hill and Onken. So we want the road that Onken Primary School is on. I'll pop up a map and see what the actual map number is, because it's 2018. We've got the Triumph Engineering Building. So you know you're on the right path. And this is a windy road, a little mill road. That's the one we want. And I haven't been down this in quite some time. Restricted. Police sound horn, so she's tight. I'm louder than my horn, so I don't need that. It's a very pretty road. That's cart malls. That's actually not that long. Excellent. So see the signpost there, left for Hillbury. And this is the only junction. Come oh, on, he's just let me past. Wasn't pulling in, nice. has developed quite a problem of staying in fourth gear if I'm not loading it up. Doesn't like tootling in fourth. I don't like tootling in fourth, but that's easier to fix. <laughs> yeah. Ok, 
Okay, so it looks like they've done some patchwork recently. Probably with the new renovations that have gone from Hillbury. But it is not a nice road. Boom, here we are. 40 sign, opens up. Hillbury. Okay, so we're rolling. Now I can see from here, that sign says trespassers will be prosecuted. So, Hillbury's private. But it looks like it's got amenities. So this is all a big private sort of stand. Doesn't look particularly finished. Nice viewing area though, if you own the land, why not capitalise on it? Well, there is a fence over there. I wonder if that's a change out. I'm wearing pretty bright stuff, we'll go and have a nosy. Uh, oh, so that's it's that little section there. Oh, there is a clearway. I'm sure I saw a grandstand here the other day. Where it's disappeared to. No one's too sure. The last time I was here was a couple of years ago. And none of that was there. It was just a field. And you jumped over a little stream. Pool. Barbed wire. Right, okay. Oh, I didn't spot that from the road. There's the stream that you had to jump over. So that must be private. That's private behind there. And they're blocking the fences. But there's an area here. You're trapped once you're in it. You can't get back through the fields anymore, doesn't look like. Unless you travel over there. So I wonder. Are they going to charge you to walk through? Are you even allowed to walk through? Let's see what this sign says. There's no restricted spots. So you'll be able to stand behind the wall here. Ah, breaking markers. Or corner markers, whatever they are. Three, two, one, such. Excellent, okay. Looks like you can watch it, Hillbury, in there. But you gotta pay to get in there, maybe. I think I'm gonna have to come back when there's practices on and this area is up and running. Well, that was nice. Pulled in because I've uh, spotted those two gents there putting the fence up. So I'm gonna go and ask them about Hellbury. Just bumped into two lads, Dave and Howard. Having a nice chat about bikes and stuff. Fantastic, and there's also a crowd up at the Craig, so TT is nearly here. I'm not going to film these boys without their permission, so wait while I go and speak to them. Well, there we go. TT is very social. It's a load of bikers chatting about bikes all the time, watching some bikes in it. It's fantastic. But hey ho, went and spoke to the chaps over there. The whole area that is fenced off is pay to entry and there will be a grandstand going up but it is currently down in Castletown for the pre-TT stuff and the Southern 100 and then it will be coming and get set up. The extra little passage over by that little gate past the barbed wire is private land. It's nothing to do with those boys and you can go on it. Well, people do go on it but I couldn't see any way to get there so... If you want to go spectate there, maybe go hop over the fence, because I don't think you can get around the back. No one's going to particularly mind if you're not being an arsehole about it, you know. No litter, don't be a dick, standard stuff. And there, uh, that's Hillbury. Very fast section since they redid the corner up the top. That's been done for a few years. Long sweeping corner, exhilarating, and you know how to get to and from it on closed roads. So, if you found this helpful, give it a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and if you want me to go and see any other spots, drop it in the comment below. Peace!